My next guest is children's author Shanice Guidry. Her latest book, To Be Awakened by a Trumpet Player, is a trip through the jazz world from New Orleans to Oakland and back. She's here to tell us all about it. Shanice Guidry, welcome to Black Renaissance. Thank you for having me today, Janice. What got you started? You were not originally a children's book writer. Tell me a little bit about how that, how you made that pivot. Yeah, it's, it's an interesting journey. I mean, no, I, I, I didn't start off originally with wanting to be a writer. It just, it just one day it just happened. I mean, my soul was just awakened and I just wanted to use my creativity to help encourage kids. And that's that was beautiful. Great. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. I love it. And you took a path you kind of went around the publishing process. How did you do it? Yeah, so that's that's another interesting journey. Uh, I, I met colleagues that wrote books and I just, you know, attended book fairs. And then I just decided, you know, when I first wrote the story, like, how can I get going? And so I, I met someone who edited my manuscript. And then from there, I decided, I said, you know, let me go a little bit further. Research publishing companies and... That's, that's how the journey all began with uh, getting the books published. Now, yes. Yes. this story, To Be Awakened by a Trumpet Player, that takes us on a journey. We follow Harlem and Robbie. We, they go all the way from New York to Louisiana to Oakland. So there's a lot to learn here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, a lot. Um, basically, I, I thought about, okay, I was born and raised in Oakland, so I was like, there's history here. Um, history in New York, you know, with the Harlem Renaissance area, with the jazz and art. And then my, you know, background with uh, my grandfather being from Louisiana and then visiting Louisiana. I said, you know what, let me use my creativity and put this in a book uh, for the journey of Harlem and Robbie and him discovering that he wants to be a trumpet player. And that way he gets to travel to all these places that have, you know, the history of jazz and that uses his guide into becoming, you know, a trumpet player. And I love how you weave in the archangel with the trumpet playing yeah. and they're not sure if he's an angel or what. I think that's really sweet. And you know, even though the words are pretty long, this is a mm -hmm. chance for parents to read to their kids. Tell me yeah. about the importance of reading for children and for parents to participate. You know, it's really important because it gives parents that time to spend time with their kids and, you know, which is needed. I mean, there's so much going on in the world and just giving them that personal moment to read to their kids. And actually, and it helps kid, uh, parents to reflect back on moments when they were kids. And it, and it also helps with just, you know, giving that support, you know, knowing that they their parents is around and, you know, Absolutely. they can reflect back. Yeah. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And children do better in school across the board, especially when you have that bedtime ritual. So. These exactly. books are perfect for that. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Shani Skidri, thank you so much for sharing them with us on Black Renaissance. I thank really you. appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for having me today. I really appreciate it. My gratitude. Be sure to check out Shanice's book, To Be Awakened by a Trumpet Player, due out in July, and her first book, Princesses Have Awkward Lives, available on Amazon and independent bookstores nationwide.